Here we have a 2000, 2007 K1200R, a BMW K1200. This is a salvage title bike, which we were trying to sell as a whole. It was laid down on its left side. You can see the scratch and rash on the fender here, as well as the side cover and the shroud there. It did break off the shifter and the peg, so I have a little vice grip here set up to show the transmission does shift properly. Uh, we ran into a bit of an issue with this particular bike here. Um, the key is all messed up in there and I can't get it to turn at all. So what I ended up doing was taking another lock set to another bike we had, another ECU, to get the bike to run. So when you go and buy the bike, you will need to get a new ignition lock for this bike. As of right now, I have a different ECU in here just so I can show you the bike running. This bike does run and drive as it's supposed to. Now we'll show you that momentarily. This bike does have 75,226 miles on it. Uh, heated grips do work. Everything appears to be straight on this bike. One thing you will notice, it says lamp failure. The reason it says lamp failure is because it do not have the right ECU for this particular bike. But I do have one that is functional. Looks like the can caught a little bit of rash and a dent here. You got a little bit of rash here on your clutch. Clutch uh, Let's see, your mirror. Mirror is intact. It's gonna need a little bolt adjustment. Uh, I did notice here on the tank, there is a crack right in here. And there's a crack underneath the seat where that plastic mounts up into there. Now, like I said, this is a different ECU that belongs, does not belong with the bike, but it does work the bike. So you got a little bit of rash here on the clutch lever. I did loosen the clutch in order to get it to push properly. That will be tightened up when the bike's all buttoned up. And you got a little bit of nicks here. There we go. The motor is a little noisy. It does have high miles on it. Here. Here. And six here. 
was a little bit of a hiccup there. Like I said, I was using my skirts instead of downshift and upshift. If you have any questions about this bike or any other bikes, feel free to look us up on Facebook and on eBay at RB Cycle Salvage or find our new parts website at rbcyclesalvage.com. Thank you.